Hello everybody, welcome back to another part of our 100 Baby Extreme Rags to Ridges Every Lot Challenge challenge with our girl Prudence, who is trying to have 100 babies in really pretty ridiculous conditions. You might notice a little bit of a change. I did do some stuff in between sessions. I made sure I calculated how much I would make on the produce that I sold in the vending at the vendor, and then like made sure the money reflected that and not like full value, which is what happens if you sell it from your inventory. Um, because there was the whole issue of bringing it out of the inventory and laying it all out. It's, it's a pain in the butt. Anyway, I want to dive right in because I think we're going to have some stuff happening. The last part, Henrietta died. Henrietta Jr., RIP. Um, got some closure there. And I think we are going to start off by purchasing a chicken and wasting some of the little money we have left. Let's do it! Let's do this. Let's. Oh, they're all out in the cold. She is pregnant. Okay, how pregnant is she? Hmm, not even sick. Dang, she's pretty big for second trimester. Purchase chickens. Let's get. Um. Should I get? A hen chick and a rooster chick just so I can afford it and then raise them from there yes I did it I'm so glad you all agree with me <laughs> okay yeah let's set them up oh I need to do a little quick tour of the house don't I it's dark right now but there's lights in every room okay um, could you get out of the house please <laughs> um, okay Sadie anyway so this is a little kitchen area Again, it's the same stuff as before. I didn't like sell anything because that's part of the challenge, right? We don't sell stuff uh, and replace it. Once we have it, we have it, which is why we've still got um, all of this in here. Yeah. Um, so this is kind of the living space. I did bring, I was able to bring toys inside. So that's something I was excited about. So we've got that. We've got a downstairs bathroom. The master bedroom with the little bassinets and the computer in there. The toddler room with a potty. And then upstairs we've got two more bathrooms. Not fully furnished obviously because I couldn't afford it but they're there. They exist. Um, with the bathtub out so like we actually have a third area that people can be um, bathing. And then kind of what I'm envisioning is a kid room but they can sleep wherever I don't care. But it's got like a ch it's got some activities in it. So like the chess table, the thing that catches on fire, science kit, like all that stuff, and then just some more beds in here with the monster prevention lights. So that's kind of like the inside, and then we've we've got a t the tent, the slide, and the monkey bars out here with a little cooler, and uh, Bianca's over here, our gardens over here and our chickens are now here and then our kind of collection stuff in the basketball goal is back here so that's kind of what we got going on in the house so let's get everybody kind of ready for bed you are pregnant so use the bathroom just gonna have a couple times you have an a i believe yeah you just need to get your skill up so we'll do that I might keep her home from school tomorrow. Anyway, you can use the bathroom and sleep. And you can sleep. And you can sleep. And you can sleep. Oh no, you're full of energy. You need food. Do we have food? We do. Look at that. Eat the BLT sandwich. And I guess you can work on some of your skills. Communication. Oh, you have a bear in here. Well, it's Bigfoot, but. All right. So I think I'm ready to do this. Once this. I wish the animals would get out of my house. 
I'm being honest with you. That's what I wish would happen. Why are you eating in the rain? Body. No, why would you run inside? You're already inside. You're in this very nice house for the first time in a long time. You're actually getting to work up your skills inside of a house, okay? Like, be appreciative, please. Alright. It's 13's birthday. I think it's also 11's birthday. He's probably not going to get us thinking up. Now, what can we do? Um, we can watch Gidri. That's what we can do. Or not. Can we watch this puppy? No, I don't know if that's a good idea. It seems pretty aggressive. It can, he can go upstairs. So. I might get him to play with this. And in doing so, he'll get his movement skill up. Already, already something is broken. Okay. Okay, it's fine. Use the bathroom. Take a shower. Get leftovers. And then you can practice typing. Alright, can you wake up so your mother can teach you flashcards? Okay. Flashcards teach numbers. Why did you go back to sleep? Yeah, girl, I know. It's a little creepy in here. Can you just teach your child flashcards, please? I mean, no? Okay, instead, why don't you ask your mother why? Why, why are things the way they are, Mother? Why is our life so difficult? Why is everything bad all the time? Can you tell me that, Mom? Why is everything bad all the time? Yeah! Okay, so let's age them up. Oh, it's spoiled. Darn it. Which means we're going to have to make another cake. Some oh, I have eggs. No need to be worried. I think I have the other stuff in here to cook. What can I cook to make a cake? I don't have enough. I need sugar and flour. Order a delivery. Shall I order a delivery? I don't know why I'm speaking like that. <sighs> We've actually had a pretty big day. It was my birthday this week. And I went out to eat with my family today. It was very nice. Very nice indeed. Mm -hmm. I need sugar. Okay. Alright. Super efficient baby care. And then it is 13's birthday, I believe. Let me double check. Yes, it's both their birthday. Mm-hmm. Yeah. We are silly. Okay, I'll take silly. 
silly is better than fussy. Oh, look how cute she is. Look how adorable. Well, I'm not surprised. In the meantime, you can just do whatever the heck you want while I make cake. Let me just add ice to this refrigerator. No, it's still okay. Unload delivery back. I know 12 is hungry. I am trying to manage a million things, 12. Here. Let me just feed all of the toddlers just for good measure. Eat. 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 There we go. Now, let me just check the poll because I believe the census was that I can sell sell stuff. Let me check the poll. Um, community thoughts on creating. Okay. And is selling the oddities that are on my Sims lot from the haunted house type cheating with an extreme rags to riches challenge. And the reason I asked it all is because like if you can sell books like by publishing them or sell things on Plopsy, then why can't I just click sell on an item that comes with selling as an option. It's not like I'm dragging it like here to sell. So that's why I was asking. Um, and five people voted, one person voted no, and the other four voted that it's okay. So I'm gonna go with that. I said I was gonna go with that. No one else voted, so that's what I'm gonna do. Because what that's gonna allow me to do is if I can find a place to put it, sell to oddity collector do you see and then this haunted house won't be the worst thing that's ever happened to me anymore I mean, it's still pretty crappy but you know we got we got good things too from it and then you can cook a cake yeah look at that 1500 right there. It saved us. This vote has saved us. I'm going to let like any of those major decisions like that happen via vote, I think, because I mean, it just makes sense to me. Okay. Raises responsibility. That's what I'm worried about. Okay. Now, you're scared, you're miserable, as per usual. So why don't you watch your mother for a while? I spend so much time paused in this save, just trying to minimize chaos. Okay. Watch, watch, watch. I wonder if she's pregnant with twins. She could be. And if she does, that would be 15. And 15 equals being able to um, remove a lot challenge. Because we do that every five babies. We roll a random number generator to remove a lot challenge. And that's from James Turner's challenge. Is that where I got that idea? Um, which I've mentioned in the description box. Okay. While she's doing that, you can, you need to play an instrument. I think I'm going to have eight call in today. I'm going to start doing this too because they have vacation days and she's already an A student. And so I can focus on her um, aspiration, which is another rule that I have in the game. Now, you're not an A student yet, are you? No, and you also have not done your homework, so... That's what we're doing, buddy. Homework. Yeah, she can like cooking. That's great. I don't really care what you're doing. Because you're about to age up into a child. 
Okay, and so what you can do is come in here and practice typing. Because you need to do that for, oh no, you need to do typing game. Oh, that was, that would have been bad if I spent a lot of time on that. I would have been sad. I would have been sad by that. Yeah, finish your homework. Okay. And then go to school. Good job, buddy. Okay. No. Oh, God. I was afraid someone had eaten, taken a bite of cake. I wouldn't have been surprised, really. No, you're not putting 12 to bed. They can go to bed by themselves if they want to go to bed. I've done nothing to take care of anything today. Get up. We're aging up. we got things to do. No blow up candles. 11. 13. Just go to bed. Like you have the ability to just go to bed. You should still be playing until you get a high skill. Um. You okay? Everything okay there? You're a little big for that. You're a little big for that. 12. Go to bed. Oh my god. These children. She's got to score, get a high score. 11 aged up. Erratic. Love that. Love that. Okay, so let's do a random number generator. 1 through 4. Um, random number generator. Speak. I want you guys to hear it. One, two, four. Let me turn the volume up here. Oh, it's not going to say it. It's two. I got a two, which is mental. Okay. I think mental's not one of the bad ones. I don't remember, honestly. Got gifts in the mail. That's always nice. Now, you're tired. Look what you can do. You can take a shower and then you can come to sleep. And you can eat your food. You're still playing your game. Now I need to scatter, feed, collect the eggs that were left over from Henrietta Jr. before she um, went to the chicken coop in the sky. Starving. Cool. Name. Cricket, sounds good to me. Buttercup. Okay. Turn in on time. Oh, is he working hard? No, he's not. Girl, just eat your sandwich. Okay. Clean shed. Call over Bianca. Oh man. Alright. One of these is broken. Repair. Use elbow grease. Use elbow grease. Okay. And then we've got to clean, feed, shear, clean. <sighs> Her life is busy, you know. Okay. Has she not won this yet? Oh, she did. Good job, girl. Good job. Oh, no. What have I done? Bad birthday candles. Oh, that was a pristine reputation. Love that for Prudence. She's amazing. Yeah, I know. The whole house smells bad. Oh, but now you need to, after you eat your leftovers, you can play on this. Okay. Then she can scavenge for parts. 
You are a cute kitty, Delilah. Whoa, the lag. Okay, nobody panic. Let me just... Oh God, oh God, the lag. Just save, please just save. Please, please, please successfully save. Guys, the suspense is killing me. Well, I think I figured out what the issue was. I didn't have my laptop charging, and so it was struggling because it was almost dead. So it's a good thing it started lagging, otherwise I probably would have just lost everything, including the recording. So we're going to consider that a good thing. Not the Sims' fault at all. Okay. All right. Let's go, let's go. What do I need to do with these plants? Anything? Nope. Take the gift. Busy girl. Yeah. How quickly does this get her skill up? Nope, keep playing. Not not bad at all. Because once she does this, she'll actually be able to age up. Okay. Can you just go talk to them, please? Stop and play. I need you to play about a million more times. Okay? So I can age you up. Okay. And you can go to the bathroom. Oh my god, everything is broken. She's gonna have a potty accident anyway. Repair. Clean. And then take a shower. Because you're about to be gross. You just do as I told you because I want you to age up into a teenager so you can help me potty train babies. Because we got two babies. One needs to potty train and mommy has no time. Okay, 10 is still a B. Would you just play, please? Mm, okay, you also need to have a good time. Creativity is your thing. Alright. So why don't you play in the tent? Okay. Alright. Oh look! There's nine! Welcome back, nine! Okay. Level nine? Let's say we need one more full round of these, and then she should be high enough level. <sighs> Alright, you can eat, but I need you to run down here and haggle, sell, haggle, buy. I told you to play make-believe! Well, at least he's having a good time. Oh, it didn't work! Man, I can't remember the last time it didn't work. <sighs> oh well. Let me see if it works this time. I just want to know if there's any golden... Nope, no golden llama. Treats. Why don't you come over here and shower in the rain? <gasps> yes! That's what's up! Eight. That's right, queen. That's right. Ready to age up to find gravity. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and do that because I need someone to help me with... Um, infants. Well, they're not infants yet. 
we don't have infants yet. We're going to probably early next year, but last I heard. Yeah, that's right. Age up. Genius. Well, that's probably going to help. Let's do a knowledge one since she's a genius. Okay. Because that one doesn't matter, so I can just pick them. Okay. So she needs one skill to level three. Um. Let me see if I can't get her up. And then potty train 13. Oh, hey. <laughs> Don't mind me. Don't mind me just being naked. <laughs> like you do. Mm, okay. Disco nap three times. There's no way she is going to get an A and move out by end of the day tomorrow. So I'm just going to have her try to do really good at school tomorrow and then spend the weekend getting her skills up. He, on the other hand, could potentially get an A. Mm -hmm. She does need to work up her responsibility. No, she doesn't. That's right, you acquired the potty training skill. Mm -hmm. Lock for all pets. Lock for all dogs. Lock for all cats. Stay out. Okay. We'll do one more. One more potty train. Yeah! She is amazing, Gidri. It's a toddler. You've seen many of my children be potty trained. I think you've potty trained a few of them. You're basically their dad at this point. Did you do your homework? homework. Okay. And then she can actually help with your homework. Okay. Help with homework. Now do extra credit. And she can help with homework again. Is that dog just barking at my child? Girl, don't eat stuff off the ground. I will give you another one. I need to... I need to get more... Order more food. Okay. I just fed them. What's the point in locking this door if they're just going to walk right in? Alright. He can, eat, can do his homework too. Do your extra credit. And then get up here and go to sleep. Alright. What are you doing? You're just talking. You've got to pee and you're just choosing to talk to plants. Makes complete sense. I was hoping that she would get to have her baby this episode. Because I want to know. I want to know. Oh, I don't know. You can't do extra credit yet. You can do his school project, though. Is there a place I could put it in here that won't mess up anything? No. Here it is. 
You need to watch your brother just a couple more times and then you can use the blocks. That's what I'm trying to say. Same for you. Choices. We're about to get to the part where my kids start dying, probably. My older kids. And so everyone's going to be sad all the time. Okay. Can you get out? Okay. Now we need to go up here and upgrade some more beds. I think she's already upgraded with that one as far as she can. Yeah, she's not high enough level yet for the other ones. Upgrade massage controls, upgrade. She's already done this one. Alright, and then we need to repair this one. I just want them to gain more energy more quickly. Is he just out in the rain? Sorry, bud. Just just get your grades up. Mm-hmm. Uh, you repaired that one. That's good. Did you finish this upgrade? No. You did not. Yes, yeah, someone is controlling her life. I'm controlling her life. Okay, upgrade massage controls. Oh my god, just go to the bathroom. Alright. <sighs> These children. Order a delivery. Zoomers food delivery. Let's see. I forgot two, four, six. So six times six. Math skills coming in clutch. Are you just. That looks absolutely horrendous. <laughs> Absolutely horrendous. Oh, actually, you can come over. No, she can't because she's a teen. I forgot. Okay. Yeah, nice work, bud. You guys are about to have to go to school anyway, so I don't know. It doesn't really matter, but. Alright, come down here and just play make believe about a million times. Leave your mother alone. You go potty and then babble to this thing a million times. Just skill building on that skill building grind. Always skill build. No, don't give him a bath. You've got things to take care of. You need to go downstairs and accept this delivery and eat food. So you stop being so uncomfortable. Oh no! Well, that's okay. Because I can't afford to replace it because you lovely, beautiful human beings allowed me. Allowed me? To sell those things. Um, I hate when I do this. You can get leftovers. Alright. Off to school. That's right. Study hard. Study hard. Study hard. Now what's wrong with you? You're tired. Okay. Well then you can sleep. That is within your ability, child. Go potty and then sleep. 
Okay. Now, if you're still very uncomfortable, so you're not going to do any of that. Refill feed, clean shed. <laughs> they need to age up. Like, what am I supposed to do with this? Put it in this trash can over here. It's not my trash can, but I want to reduce the number of trash plants I have in my family inventory. I don't know if she's going to have her baby this time. I really want her to. Mm -hmm. Clean. Feed. Shear. I can't collect eggs yet. 16 minutes. I literally just cleaned you. Why do you look so crappy? Raises responsibility. That is what we're all about here. Mm. I don't care. I don't care. <sighs> check the mail as well. I accidentally came out there, didn't it? Our oh, it's happening! It's happening! This is not a drill! She's in labor! <sighs> Cross-stitch pattern. Alright, let's have this baby. Let's have this baby and see. I think it's probably just 14. And honestly, overall, it would be best for Prudence and her lifespan if we just had one baby. But I really want it to be 15 babies. I really want it to be 15. Because I want to remove another lot, right? Girl, come in here and have your child. It's love day. Perfect day to get pregnant again if you can. Okay. Alright. Is it 14 or 14 and 15? What do we got? What do we got? Uh-huh. Always, always very difficult, I know. Okay, 14. It's a girl. <gasps> yes! 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 Guys, that means we are ending this part with removing another lot challenge. Okay. Okay, let's finish having the babies. Let's do super efficient baby care, and then feed, cuddle, change diaper. Now, we have Haunted House counts as 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, okay? And so what we do is we do a number generator, uh, 1 through 14, and it is 7. What is 7? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. I don't think we ever had to actually do anything to us. <laughs> Why? Man. Okay. I really wanted to be cats or dogs or the haunted house or creepy crawlies or honestly any of them. They all freaking stink. Okay. Well, that's okay. That's another one down. Only five more babies to go to remove another one. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. As we try to have 100 babies in these horrid conditions. Thank you. Bye.